it's always hard to choose a food for our pet because they are loaded with lot of chemicals and also not so economical let's prepare our own homemade food for our month's baby pet for this we need 500 grams of organic wheat flour and 500 grams of milk powder and we need to fry the wheat flour so teddy is 2 and 1/2 months old female lassa apso I've started preparing this food for Teddy since she is one and a half month old. This might look expensive, but compared to the store bought food, it is much economical and cheaper. And also, it is very healthy since it doesn't have any chemicals in it. I've taken 500 grams of milk powder, which is made for infants. So 500 grams of wheat flour and 500 grams of milk powder is equals to one kg of uh, porridge powder, which we are going to prepare now. Make sure the wheat flour is cooled down before you add the milk powder into it to avoid lumps. Mix it well until both the ingredients become one. Make sure you cool down the wheat flour before you mix the milk powder into it, else it will go into lumps. Now it is mixed well and it looks just like the store bought cerealac or the porridge. The consistency, thickness, and everything looks as it is. Teddy is smart enough to understand that this food is for Teddy. Store it in a airtight container for a long shelf life. Now just cook and see if Teddy likes it or not, and the way she likes the store bought meal. I have taken three scoops of uh, powder. for which i'm going to add 1 and 1/2 glass of water because teddy likes it in a milky consistency if your pet likes in a thick consistency add less water to it first i have to add little water and mix the powder very well so that there won't be any lumps in it once it is mixed well we need to add the required amount of water Yeah. Teddy is very much excited to taste it. And uh, Teddy understood that it's her food. <coughs> I'm adding one and a half glass of water to it for a milky consistency, as I said before. Put it on the stove and stir it continuously. If you do not stir it, it turn into lumps. Add little amount of sugar for a tasty porridge. Keep it until it reaches a boiling point, like a foam consistency. And now it is ready. Let's switch off the flame. and cold on the porridge to a room temperature before giving any new foods to your infant pet please consult your doctor we have achieved the milky consistency which teddy likes let's cool down the porridge and give it to your pet i'm sure your pet is going to enjoy this
Let's see how Teddy is going to react for this. You like it, Teddy? 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 Teddy, show your face, show your face. <laughs> Saying thank you to me. Yes, Teddy. So that's all about this law cooking your own food for your infant pet and hope you all love this video keep food and water for your baby pet always hope you loved the vlog with teddy and if you like this please subscribe and thumbs up